everybody and welcome back to my channel so for today's video I wanted to try out a challenge and I know the highlight challenge has been out there like crazy and you know who doesn't love highlights so I wanted to try out the highlight challenge and the highlight challenge is basically you do your full face makeup with nothing but highlight products this challenge was created by a youtuber named Myra and she's from Dubai so I'm going to link her YouTube channel on my description box if you guys want to go check out the first highlight challenge video that she created I believe it wasn't a challenge when she did it guys I am like super excited because I love highlight and you know that's one of the biggest makeup thing now is the highlight so I'm pretty sure a lot of you guys love it so um you guys should give it a try and comment on my YouTube channel if you guys want to know how my challenge comes out, just keep watching. So I'm going to be using my L'Oreal True Match Lumi Illuminizer. And I'm going to be using this as a moisturizer and a primer. This is basically a highlight primer. You're supposed to put this before your highlighter. But we're going to put this all over our face. And I am going to do this with my hands. I just feel like it's way easier and still looks nice. I know it looks kind of dark on me right now or I don't know just really weird because I've never put this all over my face but we're not done so let's see how it comes out and actually I forgot to say this is in the shade N201 rose so it kind of have like like a pink undertone so I mean, that's what's going on in my face we are gonna start with our eyes and we are going to be using our Lorac Pro Palette. I just love these colors. They're super pigmented and they just last so long and they're just so beautiful. So these actually have um, the matte colors and, and all these shimmery colors in the bottom. So we're going to be using the bottom colors only. First I'm going to be priming my eyes with my primer from Palladio. It's really hard to see the name but I got this one at Sally's if you guys are interested. I really like this primer it was just an emergency primer I had to buy because I had forgot mine at that time and oof. we're gonna start by adding my primer onto my lids first I'm gonna be going in with the color champagne from my Lorac palette and I'm gonna be adding this all on my inner lid so next I'm gonna be going in with the shade gold and I'm gonna put this all in the center of my lid so I'm going to go in with the purple from the Lark palette as well using a Morphe 139 brush. I'm just going to get a makeup remover and clean out the outer side of my eye. And of course you want to have a very nice brow bone highlight so I'm going to go back in with nude and champagne. And I'm just going to mix both of these because they're just both so beautiful. Okay, so for eyelashes, I do have this um, LA Splash 5 Pair Lash Kit. So I'm going to be using the very last ones, and these are called Nikki. I wanted to try out some different eyelashes, and I ended up finding this LA Splash 5 Lash Kit. I believe, I am not 100% sure, they have like different kits, because where I bought this, they only have this one. So if they do, this is the Hollywood styled ones. I'm guessing these are the dramatic ones because they do look very, very dramatic. Okay, so now moving on to my face. I'm using some concealer to cover up and I'm not going to add a lot because I don't want this to um, overpower my face with all my highlight. Okay, so now for the fun part, we are going to be slathering, 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 slathering our highlighters on. And I'm going to be using two different highlighters for my face. So first I'm going to be going in with my MAC Mineralizing Skin Finish Highlighter. And this is in B09 Comfort. And the next highlighter I'm going to be using is my highlighter from Becca. And this one is in Champagne Pop. So I'm just going to go in with the MAC one and then with the Becca one and just start packing this all over my face. I'm 
going to be going in with two different bronzers. I'm going to be using my Too Faced Sunny Bunny bronzer and this bronzer from Love and Beauty. And if you guys don't know Love and Beauty, it is from Forever 21. And I'm going to be using my Real Technique brush in 300. Just like the highlights, I'm going to be going with both of my bronzers and just start to do like a bronzy contour. And I'm going to be putting this on my nose a little bit just so my nose looks a little bit contoured since I look super glowy already. For blush, I'm going to be using my cream blush from All May. This is in 010 Pink Rose and it does have a very nice glow to it. It's not a matte blush. Just, I'm not really a blush person, so I don't really use blushes, but I'll go ahead and add some blush for you guys. So I'm just going to add this with my finger, a very little amount. Okay, so I just wanted my eyes to pop a little bit more because I have super dramatic eyelashes and I just feel like these lashes cover up all the eyeshadow. So I'm going to be going in with my Stella Magnificent Metal Eye Gold Eyeshadow. This one is in Complex Gold and it is so damn pretty. The first time I got this, I added so much. It looks so horrible, but if you guys have these, just add a little bit to it at a time and it will glow. I'm going to be going in with my Anastasia Gleam Kit and I'm going to be highlighting the actual highlight points of my face and I'm going to be using Starbust and Crush Pro. I'm going to be using a matte lipstick and I'm going to highlight it, if that makes any sense. So I'm going to be going in with my Lip Contour Liquid Lipstick from LA Splash and this one is in Latte Confession. It's like a very natural dark pink lipstick, if that makes sense. You can always add a different lip color if you want. I really like how her lipstick looked and it looked really nice. You know, it just made all her face even look more glowy. I'm going to be adding, on top of that because the lipstick is matte, I'm going to be adding a lip balm and this one is from L'Oreal. And this one is in, this, in the shade 818 Nourish Nude. So it's just a very nude lip balm that I'm just going to add on top to give it a little bit of shine. Okay, so I'm going to be adding some of my loose pigment eyeshadow from Bare Minerals and I'm going to use it to highlight the points of my lips. So I'm just going to use a small brush, they're adding very little amount of powder and just highlighting the areas. Okay, you guys, so this is it. This is the final look for the highlight challenge. I hope you guys really enjoyed this video like I did. My face is like really glowing right now. And it is kind of difficult to see exactly every little glow on my skin. But trust me, I'm telling you, I have a lot. I'm going to be posting pictures on my Instagram. If you guys don't follow me on Instagram yet, I'm going to link my name on my description box. If you guys want to search me, my name on Instagram is Jocelyn Aquino underscore score MUA so you guys can go and check that picture out so yeah you guys I am very happy I tried this challenge it is very glowy like I said it's very hot where I live and I'm pretty sure I'm going to be like another sun by my house because it's really glowy but it's super super beautiful she actually came out with like the perfect idea of you know everybody loves highlight and to do all your makeup with like 
such awesome highlight colors it just makes everything with makeup so much fun you know if you guys like this challenge i challenge you to try this challenge out if you guys do you guys can take a picture and tag me on my instagram and if you guys are interested in these chokers this is a self-made choker that i made because every single time i go to forever 21 they're always sold out everywhere i go they're just sold out and i just got tired of it so i did buy a some lace fabric and i made my own choker so if you guys are interested in knowing how to make your own choker i'll be more than happy to do a diy choker video for you guys if you guys are interested please leave me a comment down below and i would get straight to that video and they're super easy to make very affordable and they are also really comfortable my finger still fits in here and it's actually not like loose so it'll be falling please don't forget to subscribe to my channel or like this video if you guys enjoyed it and i'll see you guys in my next video bye